after learning about the theory concepts of structures using diagrams now we are ready to go for a sample program but before that i must tell you that there are two very important operators when we people work in structures these operators are termed as member access operators there are two kinds of member access operators one is called dot operator and another is arrow operator we make this arrow by first typing minus symbol then greater than symbol so arrow operator uh, we will be covering in the next lecture because arrow operator is used when we people work with pointer to structure right now we are going to work with dot operator so let me show you a sample program this is the program whereby we are going to create a structure called students and we will be reading the values into these members like registration number reg underscore no and we have taken three variables for reading the marks in three subjects the names of the variables are like mk1 mk2 mk3 uh, let me again uh, tell you that struct is the keyword of c language and here in this example i have given the structure tag as students so this constitutes your structure specification this is your structure specification now we are going to declare a structure variable so as you know structure variable is the physical entity the space will be allocated for these members only and only when you declare one or more structure variables so here i am going for one structure variable so the syntax is like struct keyword then name of the structure tag and name of the structure variable which could be anything i have taken it to be s where so as you might have understood by now that this structure variable will consist of multiple values and in this example those multiple members are registration number mk1 mk2 and mk3 okay now what i want to do is i want to read the values into these structure variables so here you can see i am using scanf and uh, i am using format specifiers percent ll because uh, registration number is unsigned long then all three uh, format specifiers are going to be percent ll because all the marks are in float data type so see it carefully here i want to i want to mention the name of the registration number member so what i am going to do is i cannot write directly reg underscore n know the name of the member because that would be wrong i will first have to give the name of the structure variable then the dot operator and afterwards the name of the member uh, similarly like in the second case i am going to read the value of this variable mk1 this member mk1 so i cannot write it directly like mk1 first i will have to qualify it with the name of the structure variable similarly mk2 mk3 so all the members of a structure they cannot be they cannot be mentioned their names cannot be mentioned directly but they should be preceded with the name of the structure variable and this will be qualified with this dot operator now in the next statement i am going to do nothing but uh, i have simply applied the formula of getting the percentage i have assumed 300 to be the maximum marks so that will give you the percentage and then finally percentage will be calculated and that will be displayed on the screen so i am going to execute this program let me give some hypothetical values uh, 99 is registration number 88 first value of mk1 77 second value that goes to mk2 this is the value for mk3 and here comes your result 88 is the percentage i just want to mention one more thing here i have read the values using scanf if the need be you can also initialize the values of these instance the values of these members so this is how this is the same program but here instead of reading the values from the user i am initializing the values of these uh, structure variables uh, sorry these members of the structure so what i have written is sw dot registration number is equal to 909 sw dot mk1 is equal to this thing 
as per dot mk2 99 as per dot mk3 so here i am not reading the values from the user i can also initialize them myself so the program will be executed in the same manner but it won't be asking the values because i have not uh, used scanf in this example